Hello friends. Today's topic is set difference in a relational algebra. In previous video, we have seen there are two types of operations in a relational algebra: basic or fundamental, and second is a derived. Both the operations are performed using a unary operator or a binary operator. So, what does it mean by unary and binary? Unary operator takes single relation. It works on single relation, whereas binary operator takes two relations, and it gives you output. So, set different is a fundamental but binary operator. It is taking two relations and it is working on it, and it is giving you the output. So, it select all those tuples which are present in a relation one. But not present in a relation two. Suppose there are R and S. Two relations are there. Select a difference operation. Select all the tuples which are present in first relation, which is R, but not in second relation S. So to perform set different operation on two relation. These two relations must be compatible with each other. So, what do you mean by compatible with each other? There are two conditions to make two relations compatible. Both the relations R1 and R2. Let's assume R1 and R2 are the relations. So, both the relations R1 and R2 must have same number of attributes. Okay, the degree of relation must be same. What is the degree of relation here? Is is the number of attributes it contains, and the second condition is the domain. The domain of relation should be same. What do you mean by domain? Domain is nothing but the type. The domain of ith attribute of first relation and Ith attribute of second relation must be same, and it goes on. So suppose we have two relations. So uska dono ka first jo column hai, uska type or domain same hona chahiye. The set difference operator is symbolized as a hyphen or dash. It performs binary difference between Two given relations, and it is given as R1 minus R2 equals to expression one minus expression two. The notation here is R1 minus R2. So what is R1 and what is R2 is the relation. So let's assume the same set difference operator we have in set theory. So now we have two sets R and S. R consists of one, two, three. S consists of three, four, five. So if you perform set difference operation, you will get one and two as an output. Why? Because it selects all those tuples which are present in relation one, but not in relation two. So in first relation, which is R, we have one, two, three, and from this among this one, two, three, it will not take the record which is there in second relation. So one and two exclusively are there in first relation, but three is also there in second relation. So that's why in output we get only one and two. Another point is a set difference operator is not a commutative. Union operator is a commutative. R A union B equals to B union A. But here, a minus b is not always equal to b minus a. Very important point it is. So now we have two table, student and teachers, and in both the relations we have two columns. Student is having roll number and name. Teacher is having employee ID and name. So if you perform student minus minus teacher, so we get. Only entries from the first table, and from which 
the entries of the second tables are omitted like 1 Geeta, 2 Bob, 3 Raj, 4 Elena are exclusively there in first table, first relation. 5 Sam is also there in second table and that's why it is omitted. In second example as you can see we are using projection operator so we are separating roll number column from the student and the employee ID column from the teacher. So that's why projection operator is used. So we are using set different operator only on first column of both the relations. So if you perform set difference operation, we get only 1, 2, 3, 4. So 1, 2, 3, 4 are exclusively there in first table but which are not there in second table.